Okay, now we have one, two, three, four, five, five equations, and we have to evaluate them or we have to find their values. First one, sine 60 into cos 30 plus sine 30 into cos 60. Okay. In my previous video, I discussed about 45 degrees, 30 degrees, 60 degrees, 0 and 90. If you remember them, it's very good, but that's very unlikely. So here is a small cheat sheet which will help you in finding these 30 and 60s. A, B and C. This is 60 and this is 30. If you have seen that video then you know why I am writing like this. This would be 1 over 2, this would be 1 and this would be root 3 over 2. This will help me in finding out these ratios. Sine 60. Sine 60 from this side Opposite over hypotenuse means root 3 over 2 over 1 means root 3 over 2 into cos 30. Cos 30 means adjacent over hypotenuse means root 3 over 2 plus sine 30 means opposite over hypotenuse means 1 over 2 into cos 60. Cos 60 means adjacent over hypotenuse means 1 over 2. So this gives me 3 over 4 plus 1 over 4, which is 1. So this equation has value of 1. All right. This one here. So it has 45, 30, and 60, all three. Let's look into 45. 45, 45, A, B, and C. This is 45, this is 90. Okay. So this will be X, this will be X, and this will be x root 2. It says 2 tan square 45 means 2 into tan 45 degree whole square plus this would be cos 30 degrees whole square minus sine 60 degrees whole square. Okay. So 2 into tan 45 means AB over BC means means 1 square plus cos 30 we can look here cos 30 is root 3 over 2 so this is root 3 over 2 whole square minus sine 60 sine 60 root 3 over 2 so this is root 3 over 2 whole square so this gives me 2 1 square is 1 into 2 is 2 plus this gives me 3 over 4 and this gives me 3 over 4 so which gives me this goes 0 and what I'm left with is 2. So, value of this equation would be 2. This one here, it says cos 45. 45 degree would be, we can take from here, adjacent over hypotenuse means x over x root 2 means 1 over root 2. So, cos 45 would be 1 over root 2. Let's find out sec 30 degrees which is 1 over cos 30 degrees cos 30 is root 3 over 2 so root 3 over 2 gives you 2 over root 3 okay cos 30 would be 1 over sin 30 sin 30 is 1 over 2 1 over 1 over 2 gives you 2. Let's take this first. So, sec 30 is 2 over root 3 plus cosec 30 is 2. So, this gives you 2 plus 2 root 3. If you rationalize this, this can be 2 plus 2 root 3 root 3 into root 3 over root 3 so this becomes 2 root 3 plus 2 root 3 into root 3 gives you 6 and this is 3 root 3 to root 3 gives you 3 cos 45 is 1 over root 2 
set 30 plus cosec 30 is 2 root 3 plus 6 over 3. So this will be 1 over root 2 into 3 over 2 root 3 plus 6. So this gives you 1 into 3 gives you 3 over root 2 into 2 root 3 gives you 2 root 6. 2 into 3 is 6 plus 6 root 2. We can further rationalize this. Let's multiply it by 2 root 6 minus 6 root 2 over 2 root 6 minus 6 root 2. So this will be 6 minus, this will be 3 into 6 is 18 root 2 over, this will be a plus b, a minus b means a square minus b square. So this will be 4 into 6 is 24 minus, this will be 6 into 6 is 36 into 2, 72. Okay, so if I take 6 as common here, this is root 6 minus 3 root 2 over, this would be minus 48. So this becomes negative root 6 minus 3 root 2 over 8. So this can be further simplified. I can take it as minus minus plus means 3 root 2 and this goes negative minus root 6 over 8. So the final answer is 3 root 2 minus root 6 over 8. Alright. This one here. This one here. Let's find out values of all of them individually first of all. Sine 30, 10, 45, cos 6, 60, sec 30, cos 60, and cot 45. Sec 30 is, tan 45 is 1, cos 6, 60 is 1 over sine 60. Sine 60 is root 3 over 2. So this will be 2 over root 3. Sec 30 is 1 over cos 30. Cos 30 is root 3 over 2. So this will be 2 over root 3. Cos 60. Cos 60 is 1 over 2. 1 over 2. Cot 45 is opposite to tan 45. 1. Let's take this first. Sine 30 means 1 over 2 plus tan 45 is 1 minus cos x 60 is 2 root 2 over root 3. So let's solve this first. So this gives you 3 over 2 minus 2 root 3. So 2 root 3 will give you 3 root 3 minus 4. So let's rationalize this. This will be 3 root 3 minus 5 4 over 2 root 3 into 2 root 3 over 2 root 3. So 3 root 3 into 2 root 3 gives you 3 into 2 is 6. Root 3 root 3 will be 3. So 6 into 3 is 18 minus this will be 8 root 3 over. This will be 2 root 3 into 2 root 3 will be 12. Let's take uh, 2 as common here. So this is 9 minus 4 root 3 over 6. Now let's take this up. Sec 30 is 2 root 3 plus cos 60 1 over 2 1 over 2 plus cos 45 is 1. So this is 3 over 2 plus 2 root 3. So this gives you 2 root 3. This becomes 3 root 3 plus 4. Let's rationalize this. So 3 root 3 plus 4 over 2 root 3 into 2 root 3 over 2 root 3. This becomes 3 into 2 is 6. Root 3 root 3 is 3. So 18 plus 8 root 3 over. 
this will be 4 into 3 is 12. This gives me, let's take 2 as common again, 9 plus 4 root 3 over 6. Now, this is this and this is this. So, this will be 9 minus 4 root 3 over 6 over 9 plus 4 root 3 over 6. 6, 6 cancelled. 9 minus 4 root 3 over 9 plus 4 root 3. You can further rationalize this. Let's take it as 9 minus 4 root 3 over 9 minus 4 root 3. This will be a minus b whole square. So a square plus b square means 4 into 4 is 16 into 3 is 48. Minus 2ab means 2 into 9 is 18 into 4, 72 root 3. This will be, this is a plus b, a minus b means a square minus b square means 9 square is 81 minus 4 over 3 square will be 48. So this gives me 81 plus 48, 129 minus 72 root 3 over, this is 81 minus 48 gives you 43. Let's take 3 common. So this becomes 43 minus 24 root 3 over 11. Once you take 3 common, 129 divided by 3 gives you 43, 72 divided by 3 gives you 24 and 3 will divide 43 giving you 11. So answer is 43 minus 24 root 3 over 11. Alright. This one here and right here. Let's take up this one. Okay. 5 cos square 60 means 5 into cos 60 is 1 over 2, 1 over 2 square plus 4 into sec 30, sec 30, 2 over root 3 square minus 10 45 is 1. 10 square 45 will also be. So this gives you 5 into 1 over 4 means 5 over 4 plus this will be. 4 into 4 is 16 over 3 minus 1. So this goes to 67 over 12. Let's take this one. Sin 30 is 1 over 2. Sin square 30 will be 1 over 2 square plus cos 30 is 3 root 2. So 3 root 2 square is 1 over 4 plus 3 over 4 which is 1. Okay. So this over this means 67 over 12 over 1 which is 67 over 12. So answer for this is 67 over 12. Alright, all done.